Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I will share one interview experience so that it can help you all to crack the interview. So this is the continuation of the series of Cisco interview experience. So today I got an interview experience of one student. So we will see what questions interviewer asked him and what answer he did and how should we encounter the question. So the test date was 18 Sept and the test was uh, done on hacker rank platform then he got the mail that he selected for the interview and on 27 september his interview was scheduled on like uh, after the completion of the interview he got the selection loi on 25 september and he got the final of a letter on 9th october and he joined cisco at in six on 20 31st october okay now we will see what are, what were what was the questions and what answer he did. So we will see all interview experience of him. So as we all know, basically we have three rounds. First one is the technical round, and second one is the managerial round, and third one is the HR round. So we will see first round questions. So firstly, like when interview interviewer came in the lobby, so he introduces himself, and then the in, the student introduces himself. Then the all the like I also tells in my videos like whatever you have mentioned in your resume, interviewer asks those questions only. So it is same for him only. Like it, the interviewer asked all the same question that he all the same questions from the topics that he mentioned in, in his resume. So the first question he asked is, do you know about computer network? So he said no, and like instead of directly saying no i will add on one point like you can say currently i don't have idea about it but i can learn it for more for more knowledge you can frame the question like this then the fourth question was in like he told me the on, in the fourth point like in my resume i have mentioned python as a programming language and dsa sql oops dbms like this and he asked question from those topics only he didn't go out of the subject then he started questions uh, asking questions of, uh, about python that why python why we are using python and what are the data types in python different di uh, give me a difference between the list and tuple is the string mutable and these these are the some questions what is decorator what is dictionary what is global variable and how it is different from the local variable then he asked him to open a compiler and code so the question he asked him print second largest element from the list list or array we can say and print largest element from the array or list reverse the list like in python generally we use this list and like uh, if we are using java c plus plus then Interviewer can say uh, to code in Java or uh, Python, whatever you are suitable in. And print largest element from list, reverse the list, print the character whose occurrence is twice. And in between, he asked time complexities of different sorting algorithm also. Like he mentioned that he knows about DSN all. So he questions, uh, he asked the questions accordingly. Then he said him to sort the array of zeros and ones and then he told him all the approaches like two pointer approaches and all. So he told and then he solved the problem and he was happy with that solution. Then he asked him to quickly summarize the oops concept. Then he told him and then after the coding questions he moved to the SQL part like a uh, if you can notice also like whatever he mentioned in his resume the interviewer was asking the same question python dsa now sql oops questions also so i also told in my videos like whatever you are mentioning in your resume be ready for that uh, they don't go out out of the topic generally so they asked whatever you you are giving them that we know so they will ask question from them this only then he in the SQL, he asked questions like find maximum salary from the table. What are the aggregate functions? And he then he asked to run a SQL queries on some min and max. Then he moved on the DBMS. In the DBMS, he asked what is normalization. This basic question he is asking, see. What is primary key? What is foreign key? And then he asked what are you learning these days? So he said like I am learning tree data structure. Then he asked some questions on tree. Like what is tree? Why we use tree? And what are the various methods of traversing on the tree? 
different type of tree what is a binary tree can we build tree from pre and post order then after that in the first round of interview got over so it was around two hour yeah it can vary uh, on the topics that you mentioned but i am i will advise one thing like don't mention too much that is like you can't handle or you you don't know about mention only those things that you are sure about like i can answer these things and then after that uh, completion of first round second round started and in the managerial round and it is managerial round so in the managerial round like whatever you, your manager is going to be he will take your interview so he asked questions like he mentioned me that he asked questions about project mainly questions for project about project then he asked like he was telling me like he he asked very questions very deep questions from the project like his project was related to apis so he asked like how apis work uh, behind the scene and all questions so these were these were very deep questions according to him then he asked some managerial questions like what are your biggest uh, achievement till date what are your strengths and weaknesses then he asked some situation based questions and after that uh, round 2 was over it was around 1.5 hour then round 3 started and round 3 is atr round we can say or hr round so in the hr round like it is it don't went very hard we can say like it is very easy hr comes and he asks very basic basic question then he tells you about job location bond etc and it gets over easily so for him also it got over easily and that was his interview experience i'm open to uh, give you answer you can ask the questions easily so i will reply all of your questions so if you like this interview experience uh, you can subscribe the channel and uh, like the video and one more thing like if anyone got selected so and is agree to give his interview experience that can help you all so i will feel very happy and till then keep preparing you can ask questions to me i am ready to give you answers thank you so